Okay, let's talk. I am going to be chatting about a life and a channel update, kind of, sort of. Friends, it's Serena from the Falco family where homeschool is life and having a teachable spirit is our number one goal. So I'm at an interesting place with my channel. An interesting place because yes, I've been growing, but I've been challenged with like, why am I in this space? What do I want to do with this space? And um, it, I, don't, I don't know how to explain it completely, but nevertheless, I just have to kind of document what is going on with us. So um, a, a few months ago, well, several months ago, Brian actually got a new job, which has been such a blessing in our lives, like a major blessing. And I can definitely see the Lord working in our lives and just kind of like moving towards um, our goals and the vision that he's given me for our family. With those changes, Brian has been a little bit more available to help, you know, push me through in our in our homeschool and in our lives. So that's been really exciting for our family to be able to connect even deeper, even further in our marriage and in my motherhood and in my homeschool and in um, creative business. It's just been it's been a really good thing, and I'm trying to take it slow and steady so that I can make sure that I'm learning the lessons that I need to learn along the way. I'm trying to get to the point here. <laughs> um, as far as the channel, like I said, I've been in a weird space because this channel will always be about homeschool because that is our lives. You know, there's no separating that for us. However, the way that I approach the channel and the videos, I think, I don't, I don't know. I feel it changing but I'm not sure you just have so many ideas I have so many ideas in in different ways or directions things could go and I'm just not sure where to take things if that makes any kind of sense I'm definitely going to continue to document our homeschool journey but there's just so much more to it than just homeschool days another thing that's been a challenge for me is that I love I absolutely love um, helping when I can uh, with homeschool but I think I'm entering a different stage of homeschool where my oldest is about to be in the fifth grade and I have to admit y'all I feel like the pressure you know it's not like on on but it there's a temptation for the pressure to be on it's like you're no longer in the elementary you like you're about to be out of the elementary stages and I think I have a nice secure handle on it but I just need to I <laughs> I don't know it's it's weird it's different and I've mentioned this in another video about how the kids are just moving into different stages and everything and y'all know I like to pay so much attention to them and their rhythms and their learning styles and things like that so um I'm really in a stage where I have just I'm bursting with ideas and changes that we can make in homeschool so I want to really hone in on those changes and ideas and figure out what should we change and what should we implement. Um, and that in conjunction with this channel is kind of like, it's just an overload of ideas and information. I just need a little bit of space to plan a little bit, to pray a whole lot and um, really, you know, figure out or focus in on the direction that I want to go with the channel and with our lives and our homeschool so i'm gonna be we're gonna be going on a spring break no this doesn't mean that the kids are gonna be off of school it's kind of a spring break for me i'm going to be taking a break from posting on this youtube channel um to give myself a spring break and the break i think is going to be through April and May. I feel like those two months will give me a good enough space to just kind of sit with my ideas and figure out the plan. Um, I'm really gonna be focusing on making those transitions and changes in our homeschool. In June, I'll be speaking at the Good and the Beautiful's 
conference, which I'm very excited about and very nervous at the same time, but I want to prepare um, for that because you all know this, this was not my plan to speak or to be in some type of platform where I'd be giving advice or, you know, talking about homeschool was just never my plan. So I know that it's not my plan, so it must be his plan, which means that I really need to focus in on what it is that he would have for me to share. I want to focus on that. I want to focus on the changes that we're going to make in homeschool. We're going to be spring cleaning the homeschool room and the homeschool studio because now that it's going to be warmer soon, we'll get to be out there more. Um, making those little tweaks and changes in our schedule, preparing to be outside more. I'm so excited. Basically, all the things. So I'm, I want to sit and prepare for that and take posting here on this YouTube space off of my plate. I will still be um, vlogging through my days over on my vlog channel. I'm excited to be able to rest in that way. If you want to keep up with me through April and May, you could consider joining our patron fam for um, those couple of months. So yeah, I'm really excited. I'm hoping that the majority of you understand. Um, you do not have to join the patron fam. And then this is in no way, shape, or form forcing you to go over there because I will be back in June. Um, but I need this. I need space to just really enjoy the transition into spring and the transition into um, our next level or next year of homeschool and YouTube and all those other things. So I know this has been way too chatty, but I did want to sit down and let you guys know that I am going to be a little quiet here for our spring break and I am looking forward to seeing you in June. So yeah. Please make sure you are subscribed, like this video, get excited, um, because I'm going to be back in June. I don't know what it's going to look like, but I do know that it's going to be good. <laughs>